Hey guys, Colzed here, and welcome back to Metro Fusion! So hopefully this time we'll get done what I wanted to get done. Oh, sorry about that. Hopefully we'll get done what I wanted to get done, which is... Get to this goddamn big robot dude. Which is through here, but not through here. So you have to go this way, and it's like... Alright, I've never heard that before. Okay. Fine, screw you. No Alright, we get it, love. There's no entry without authorization. Did you mean to the area I just walked into, or do we have an uninvited guest? I think we have an uninvited guest. Yep, there we go, there's the uninvited guest. Oh, for I've just gone that. God damn it. At least I'm fully healed. I mean. Going into this boss fight, you do want to kind of be mostly up to scratch. Here he is. Right, I'm going to put a power bomb. Because <laughs> you need to get rid of the... Uh... Wow, that was some slowdown. Whoa. Once again, it's the same attack as last time. It's that you'll also get caught when he jumps. And you can't touch the ground because he'll... Um... He's electrified it, because obviously he's partially damaged, so... And then you want to turn and shoot his missiles before they get you... Ah, I've taken some damage already. Alright, come on, jump out this way. There we go. You see he's a bit bluer now. Now he's all X'd. And so, yeah, that's, this is pretty much the pattern you want to... You want to walk away from him a bit, shoot his missiles. Walk away from him a bit, let him jump. Because so he'll stop jumping when you're directly above him. I think it's just programmed in that way, so. You can get a couple of hits in there, and then eventually he'll die, the brain will pop out and transform into a Supercar X. Which, you should, as, as people, you should know that now. Gets you a new beam. Beam. Ow, that hurts. But this is the wave beam. I'll explain it basically when we get it. There we go. There we go. This is the wave beam. Be beam can now penetrate walls. This is your top beam, your best beam, your uber, super, ultra, awesome beam. That means now, if we go this way, we can get like missile tanks behind doors. Watch. Ah, oh, I guess it was us that caused that. See? We can now open these doors from the other side. So, let's go back to that door it told us not to go in. Let's... Let's, let's see what the hell uh, that was about. I'm interested. I mean, in you've piked my interest game plus now as well now you can shoot through walls it's pretty easy to clear out rooms of bad guys or anything they can't do jack to you really oh god damn it should you just use a power bomb should I just use a power bomb anyway let's go over here over here and as you can see oh how do we get through this door well screw you camera I'm going through haha -ha. let's roll through what we got through here restricted zone eh I like the sound of that. Some secret stuff, eh? Anything interesting? I'm gonna save here. Anything interesting? Shut up, woman! God damn it! Alright, we get it. We haven't got authorization. It's cool. Okay, so we got some sort of glass tubing and. Holy shit! It's Metroids. I mean, in a Metroid game, you'd have Metroids, but they're all dead! What do we do? What do we do? Uh, yeah, continuity. At this point in the game, in the game timeline, all Metroids are dead. So the fact that there are some left, surprising. Very surprising. Okay, what's through here? Whoa. Yeah, see, I didn't get this when I first played through the game. When I played other games, I know this. Now, these are now the stages of Metroid. So that's it grown up. That's it. Um, like a beta, alpha, gamma forms that they transform into. I had no idea they evolved into those when I first played because I haven't played the other games but that doesn't sound good that doesn't sound good let's run towards the explosions that's a great idea but there's nowhere else to go and we get there's the SAX trying to destroy the Metroids and the Metroids fighting back Sixty. what yeah you have to space jump out of here in 60 seconds try not to hit any of the Metroids they will send you back down and you'll lose a bit of health but it's not too bad. If you're bad at space jumping, it will be. I don't know what happens. If you don't get out in 6 seconds, you die, I guess. 
that's why they gave you a save point and a nice little cutscene of the restricted area dropping off and exploding so that's the SAX done and all those Metro as well uh, a job well done Simus I must say well done congrats no not really what have you got to say for yourself Adam did you know about this Samus, you shouldn't have done that. You ignored Samus, you shouldn't have done that. You ignored your orders. I'm sorry, Dave. I can't do that. You may have to pay a price for that quite soon. Ugh. Oh, she talks. She can see the Federation has been secretly working on a Metroid breeding program. A peaceful application only, of course. Yeah, sure. Perhaps you already know this program's existence. You must have had doubts when you saw set to run. A faithful replica of the ecosystem. Ah, uh, you know, yeah, yeah. I don't know if in Alpha, Gamma, Zen, even Omega Metroids. I'm guessing Omega are super big Metroids. The research even uncovered techniques for rapid growth. Imagine creating an Omega from lava in de Ooh. The X smelled out its natural enemy and the SAX is on its way here. What? One? You're saying there's more than one? Oh, the X reproduced the asexual division. So there's loads of Samus's aboard. Well, nice, nice. Now, no, ten? At least that's not, like, an objective. Just draw the 10 SAX. Samus, you must go. Get out. If you stay till on the SAX, will destroy you. Stop only at a navigation room to open to me. Yep. Is your objective clear? Yep. Now, get going. So, there's... Uh, okay, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna run. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, there's another way. Handy. Handy elevator. Little internal monologue. The real Adam would have said the same thing about that incident, but he would have softened the blow. You know, wrapped his bat in squinchy foam. He was relentless in his criticism, but he always cared. He was a machine obsessed with duty. No compassion could exist in that computer. Foreshadowing. But anyway, where are we now? Where are we now? Sector one. Okay, we haven't been back. We haven't been here in a while. So yeah, now we're in sector one. I just, ooh, there's a secret here. Power bomb me. Yeah, I thought it was. Yeah, you want to. Oh, god damn it. You got to freeze these dudes at like the right spot. I think that was perfect. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, you can do. I completely forgot the diffusion missiles even existed. I do. They're one of those power ups that you just sort of forget about after a time. God damn it. Alright, I'm just going to roll on here because I can't be asked to deal with you right now. Cannot be asked to deal with you right now. Oh, damn it, let me out. But anyways, you know, this this area is very uh, Torian. It's very Torian feel, in my opinion. Oh, those blobs are back! I don't even know what they do. Are they like some sort of Suedo Metroid? Because they seem to have sucked my energy a bit. Ow, you see that? They seem to sort of stick to me and go. <laughs> if you didn't catch that, was. If you didn't catch that, yeah. Ooh, save room, let's save, let's hard save. Bazinga, hard save. Okay, a little bit of lag there. Door's still shut on me, I'm stupid. Let's go up. Hmm. I'm guessing we go through there. Unless there's a way to go up here. See, there's a way, I don't know which way to go, you know. Let me have a look at my map. I, let's go through this door down here because it, set, it suggests to me that um, there's something in it that's either a power up or some sort of recharge room or something so let's have a look nothing oh it's a door we can get through because we have the wave beam god where do I... Where, hang on what's this can I get through this I cannot get through this so this was a dead end but we'll have to come back this way later Aha! I love the wave beam I really really do love the wave beam I almost love it just as nearly as much as the plasma beam in Metroid Fusion Fusion? Prime we're playing Fusion Metroid Prime the power bomb in Metroid Prime was oh pl power bomb plasma. You know what? I'm not even going to talk anymore. I'm just going to ah. God damn it! There we go. Take that space pirate. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh yeah, this bit. I remember this bit. We have to fight some gold space pirates there now. They are. They are safe to say very difficult. But you plant a power bomb. The X conjoins and as you can see we can't actually do any damage unless you hit them in the back with a charge shot a back charge shot will kill them but you've got to wait till they jump over you which can be a bit of a pain in the ass and you have to defeat those gold enemies you have to turn them into gold enemies otherwise the door doesn't unlock which is a bit of a pain in the ass really uh, I didn't realize on my first but I just saved I don't need to save 
Um, you know, I did that on my first playthrough. I was like, how do I get out of this door? Because I'd absorbed all the X. Let's go right. So let's go right. So I was like, what do I do here? I think this is the same thing again. Yeah, but I don't need to. Why do I need to do it? Doesn't it? See, look, that, that X that gets caught in a. I need to morph, but there's nothing in there. I don't know why I need to do that. Okay, screw that then. Screw that then. Oh, crap. Turtles. Turtles! I like turtles! Who like turtles? I like turtles! Yes. Just freezing. Oh, whoa! Did not expect you there. I can just jump over your things. Oh, come on! Come on! Yes. It must mean we're fighting a boss. We got a boss? Yeah, we got a boss! It's Ridley, bitches! I completely forgot! Ah! Right. Your basic strat against Ridley. Oh, load your fucking missiles into him! <laughs> That's all I do. I, I just. I don't worry about damage. As you can see, I'm not worried about talking. Don't worry about damage or anything. Just. Keep firing. Keep firing. He's a bit of a pussycat, really, compared to previous Metroid games. And if you've got enough uh, missile tanks, you should be, you should have more than enough firepower to take him down. I think you can wave beam him, but I can say I'm just, ta just holding out, tapping B like I mean it. When he grab, his tail does quite a bit of damage, and when he grabs you, you'll see there he does damage per second. God, I'm running out of energy. I'm gonna die here. Aren't I? Yes, I got him! Ha ha! But it's not Ridley anymore, really. It's proper Cortex. Proper Cortex? Is it? Is it? Ow. Oh, I lost my energy and I gained there. See? Uh, hang on, let me try this. Yeah, there we go. I have died before to this Cortex after fighting Ridley because I had like an energy left. God, I could have had one more energy tank if I just figured out how to get that. That energy tank in sector 3, when I get that, that's going to feel so good. I'm going to enjoy that. I'm going to revel in that moment. And then we get some energy back here, and I don't even know what upgrade this is. What is it? The screw attack, of course. Of course it's the screw attack. I don't even know. I completely forgot we'd be fighting, Ridley. You know, surprise, boss. Surprise. So now, as you can see, our spin jump is a bit more deadly in terms of it hurts things. And we don't even have to charge our beam up. So look, we can even just go straight through... The turtles, and uh, it's fine. Now we can go this way that was blocked off before, if you remember, because now we can. Oh no, not this way. Can I? Can I do it in here? I don't think I can do it. I did power bomb the place. It's not this way. Which way is it? Which way is it? Oh, it's all the way back that way. <sighs> you know what? I'm gonna go to this save room up here. Save and end the episode here. So let's sit down. And let me tell you a story all about how my Metroid got just turned upside down. Anyway, okay. So, uh, yeah, that's it for this part of Metro Fusion. Thanks for watching. This has been Colson. Catch you on the flip side.